Hi, this is Dr. Deepa Squally, and today I'm here to talk to you about really understanding your labels. You know, these days marketing has made it really, really difficult for the average consumer to understand what claims are being made on the label. So it's also difficult for the average consumer to know what's good for them and what's not. So today I'm going to decode some of the popular words that we see on labels and tell you what they really mean. Let's start with the word hypoallergenic. So most people would assume that that just means that you can't have a reaction to the product and that's not really the case. The bottom line is that these products are showing less reactivity than others but you have to keep in mind that you have to still look at the ingredients on the label and if you've had a known reaction to a certain ingredient before you should definitely have some proceed with caution about that product. It doesn't mean that no one will react so that's very misleading. The other word that I want to talk about is non-comedogenic and what that means is, is that the product has a very low likelihood to block the pores. It really just doesn't mean anything else. It doesn't mean that it's natural, it doesn't mean it's safe, it just means that it won't block pores. So the other one is that's very misleading is the, are the words dermatologist recommended. So what that means is that one dermatologist could have given this product to one patient and recommended it. So I don't want that to mislead people into thinking that the American Academy of Dermatologists has given the product a thumbs up. That just definitely is not the case. So the other one that you want to watch for is organic. Organic means that the ingredients in the product are not grown with any kind of pesticides or any, any chemicals. So that's all that means. And then last but not least, you want to watch for the word natural because these days people are really marketing a lot of different products to be natural and they may not necessarily be. The word natural is not really regulated by the FDA and there's no definite consensus on what that really means. So, you know, if you see that word, you want to turn the label around and then read the ingredients to determine if that product is natural enough for your standards. This is Dr. Deepa Squally. Thanks for watching.